newly appointed bossa at Delta State Polytechnic, Otefe Ogara, Mr. Sunday Omokaro has held a lavish thanksgiving to celebrate his elevation from auditor to bossa of the institution. The event was a twin thanksgiving as the bossa also celebrated his 17th year marriage anniversary as he renewed his vows with his lovely wife of nearly two decades. The thanksgiving was held on Sunday, the 19th of May 2024, at Antioch Baptist Church, Mosuga, Delta State, and a sonor shortage of top dignitaries and polytechnic officials as they all took a time of their busy schedule to celebrate with Mr. Omokaro and his beloved family. The marriage anniversary was presided over by the pastor of the church, Reverend Ogene Tevani, who enjoyed the couple to remain loyal, committed, and steadfast to one another before releasing blessings on their marriage. Rounding up the Thanksgiving service reception followed at his residence still in Mosuga and he saw an influx of more guests with some who had observed both the church service such as the deputy speaker of the Delta State House of Assembly, Olorogu Barista Ato Akbo, Delta State Commissioner for Higher Education, Professor Nyarewo Tonukari, former Poly Rector, Otefe Polytechnic, Professor Emmanuel Ogujo, and more. Leading interviews, Olorogu Akbo, Professor Tonukari, and other top dignitaries congratulated Mr. Omokaru and his family before rendering them more advice and good wishes. Honorable Ato Akbo, Deputy Speaker, Delta State House of Assembly, a member representing the Chopi State Constituency. I came here to felicitate, to congratulate, and celebrate with my brother, my younger brother, who happens to emerge as the boss of uh, this institution. So I'm here to congratulate him and felicitate with him. My message to him is to, to etch his name in gold. Because when he leaves there, he will be a reference point. Everywhere I've served, I've always been a reference point. And I want him to take a group from me. Let him be a reference point. That when Omokara was bossa, these are, these are what he did. And nobody else has been able to surpass him. That's my charge to him. My name is Professor Nyerubo Tonukari, Commissioner for Higher Education, Delta State. Um, it's an exalted position that he has been given as bossa of the Polytechnic, Delta State Polytechnic, and we expect him from the government to actually use this position to run the school institution finances extremely well so that it will be stable and we can see growth in that institution. I am Ferdinand Eloke Okoro, a mass communication lecturer and presently director of CWS, Delta State Polytechnic, Otefe Ogara. Yes, my message to him is, is I, wish, I wish him well and I wish him a successful tenure during his period. I also uh, wish that uh, he will be able to treat every staff cautiously, carefully and well. My name is Dr. Joseph Ufo Manana, staff of Delta State Polytechnic, Otefi Okara. Uh, I am here to celebrate with him on this auspicious occasion. It is a good thing that he has been appointed and uh, we come to rejoice with him. And I'm indeed very happy that uh, so many dignitaries are here to honor him with their physical presence. And I don't want to be left out. So I'm here to rejoice with him. I'm Comrade Henry Obukoko Obe, the ASUP chairman, Delta State Polytechnic, Otefe Ogara. First of all, I am here to congratulate him once again uh, for his appointment as the substantive bursar of the Polytechnic. We, if you look at the environment, you notice that the cream of the Polytechnic is what you are having here. We are celebrating him because he merits the office. We are rejoicing with him and uh, we are joining every other one to also rejoice with him. Aminu Di Samwe, the Dean of Student Data State Polytechnic, Otefi Well, uh, we recognize from scripture that promotion comes from God. So, like I've always said, the moment you are elevated like this, remember the source of your promotion. You know, and he has done the right thing by going for the Thanksgiving. You know, when you do that, you have only just committed God to take care of you all through your tenure. And I see God doing the same because his name is called Faithful. Faithful is him who have appointed him who also will do it. My name is Ambassador 
angel by virtue of my position in the office I am a chief accountant with the Delta State Polytechnic Otefi Ogara the message to him is he has been an humble gentleman who carries people along and I know with this position he is going to be more humble he has been very humble I must tell you the truth I am engineer professor Emmanuel Apoyo Gujo the immediate past rector Delta State Polytechnic Ogara and the current dean faculty of engineering University of Benin, Benin City wishing well uh, why I was the rector of the Polytechnic, I appointed him as uh, auditor of the Polytechnic. And uh, let me trust you that uh, I did his work very well. He's a thoroughbred uh, accountant, and uh, because of his performance, I also wrote uh, a recommendation letter for him for this position. So I wish him well, and I'm very convinced that he will move the potential to greater height. Vincent Igor Atuma JP. I am the President General of Ogara Kingdom, and at the same time, you know, I'm of Ogara Kingdom, uh, representing where the Polytechnic is. In short, where the Polytechnic is, Otefe, I am the head of the community. Uh, Amokaro is a very good man, he's a man who has done well, who has performed well. Uh, as an auditor during the time of Professor Gujo, he performed excellently. He worked with immediate pass butter, without quarrel, without argument, and his performance was excellent. And uh, as the head of the committee, when the issue come to me that they want to be become the boss of the Polytechnic, I have no objection. Even when my people, my brothers, even applied uh, to be precise because of his performance, I single him out. So I have nothing against him. The committee have nothing against him. Uh, the committee will work with him successfully throughout his tenure. And uh, I wish him good luck. I also wish him to cooperate with the present rector, cooperate with all the principal officers of the school, and work perfectly with the staff for him uh, to make sure the name which people are calling him today that is a good man, that they know his job, so that it will be okay. Thank you very much. I am, I am Chief Lucas Onorigo, the immediate past boss of the Delta Day Protecting Hotel Fogara. In fact, it is everybody that really why I'm here with my beautiful wife. And the one I handed over to him is a, is a nice man, is a godly man. So when God has done something great for you, it's your duty to thank him. That's the reason why we all are here now to thank God. We are we are true with the church service and we are here for merriment and celebration. Just to cultivate that what God has done for him, he's appreciative of it. He's a nice man. He's my immediate successor. Um, so I'm more happier than him. If you if you leave position, you cannot hand over to anybody. Become a disgrace. But to me, I'm very very fulfilled. As it's taken off for me direct. I think I'm more happier than him. We also spoke to the celebrant and his beloved wife, and they unveiled how joyful the day has been, celebrating 17 years of marital bliss and more professional elevation, before extending their words of appreciation to guests who came to share in their joy. I'm Mr. Omokaru Sunday. The immediate appointed boss of Delta State Polytechnic Ote Fogara. I feel I felt so delighted. And above all, I give glory to God and those whom God has used to catapult me to this uh, milestone. I decided to do that because uh, since I got married to my wife named Blessing Omokaro, she has really been a blessing in my life. 
and uh, I was moving from one level to another, and from one apex to another, from one climax to another. So I decided to make it to honor her on this remarkable day. And also today mark uh, our marriage anniversary. We got married on the 19th of May, 2007. Today making it 17 years in a successful and peaceful marital life. It's like in my inaugural meeting, I told uh, my staff that uh, I will pursue excellence with uh, humility and uh, I will do my best so that at the end of my tenure, I will leave a legacy. Yes, all I have to say at this moment is to say thank you. You can see the mammal crowd accompanying me to the church and uh, with the environment, you can see what is going on. And that tells you that uh, I'm a man of the people. People love me because of uh, my humility. And I'm saying that uh, my position, this personality, will not make me to deviate from who I am. Thank you, sir. I am Mrs. Somokaro. I feel so great. I feel happy. I feel fulfilled as a woman, as a wife, as a friend, and as a sister to him. Okay, so your message to him, your advice to him? My advice to him is he should keep on moving forward. He should focus on God, have faith in God, trust in God for upliftment and for moving forward. Your message to your guests? I am telling you about my guests, thank you. I'm happy for the turn up, the crowd, the shots. I feel loved and I feel cared for and I also feel secure. I want to tell them I love them and I'll continue to pray for them and celebration will not leave their house. Thank you. My name is Akbar Henry Akbos and this is Railroad TV. Thank you for watching.